Jackie Robinson Park in Upper Manhattan, Harlem, was originally built in 1911 and had a pool added after a phase of the New Deal was passed. Through the addition of the large public pool, it promoted community among locals and invited those not in the neighborhood to join too. Taking a look at the district map, there are several forms of transportation such as the subway, several bus stops around the park, and highways allowing travel from greater distances. And right next to the park is located a city bike stand. Zooming in on the site, the pool house itself requires its own unique circulation in and around the site. Inside, you enter in the front and either go through the men's or women's locker rooms to change into swim gear. In order to access the locker rooms, you must first pass through the recreation area. In the locker rooms, you will change into your swim gear and get ready to head outside to the pool area. The Jackie Robinson Pool gets 1.1 to 1.5 million visitors per year, and it is free to anybody. It is up all around at 3 feet 6 inches. It is four times the size of a regular Olympic pool, and there's two accessible entrances. Outside, there is an entrance to the park with areas to rest and to walk a dog but it can also be a shortcut between spaces, promoting quick movement as well. A fence on the edge of the pool allows people from the outside to look in, and stairs allow entrance to the park. There is a large population of the eastern gray squirrel in this park, as well as all other parks in New York City. The pace of the park itself is slower towards the residential area, but quicker on the main road, like is diagrammed. The spacing of the arrows also gives an idea of speed of the flow of cars and the thickness of the line shows how dense it can get due to traffic. Thank you.